Yo, Brandon Talbot here. I wanted to talk to you really quick about denial versus discipline. This is something that's coming up uh, over and over in clients, uh, like conversations I'm having with my clients. If you're thinking about like foods you can't eat as denying your body something, then you're only thinking about the immediate needs that you're trying to satisfy, very short term. Kind of distracting with the fern right here. If I have the discipline to put off those things until later on so I can accomplish my goal, right? That's what successful people do. They discipline themselves. They're not denying anything. They're just simply saying, I can still eat that, but I'm going to wait until I've hit my goal and I've accomplished what I've wanted to accomplish and then I'm going to indulge. So I just want you to think real quick, I want to make this a short video, about the goals that you've set and I want you to think if you're using a denial mentality or if you are using a discipline mentality. Anyway, that's it. That's all I wanted to talk to you about. Now I have to go buy groceries because I would really like two double doubles uh, and a fry from In-N-Out and some Ben and Jerry's, oh but I'm going to go get a whole bunch of lean turkey and ground beef, veggies, and potatoes. Peace. I'll catch you on the next one. See? Strawberries, steaks, spinach, rice, potatoes, canned chicken. For those of you that complain about time being an issue, I'm gonna make a salad. Big bowl, just grab a massive handful of lettuce crap. Canned chicken, natural premium. Still tastes like crap. Lots of protein though. <laughs> Dump all the rice in there. A whole freaking bag. Those jujitsu carbs. And it's done. That took way less than five minutes. There you go. Just a big ass bowl of salad. And it's going to do everything I need it to do. So again, denial or discipline. Your choice.